Hey YouTube, this is Mr. Budget coming through with another fight video. Today I'm also joined once again by my good friend Henry. What's up? So today we're doing premium. So it is my Maelstrom versus his DP. Let's see how things go with the the two armies of Planet Cray. Justice! Somewhat justice. Alright, so we did we haven't rolled yet, so we're gonna roll to see who goes first. Nine. Right. Nine! Well dude. Nine. <laughs> Great. Copying me, I see. Oh, boy. Five. All right. Seven. I'm going first. See that you had to come here with the, with the matching sleeves and mat. Exactly. You got to represent. Different fight. Coming for your life. Yeah, I heard that, right? Let, let, let them know. Let them know somebody wants to come at them. So I will send back two. Oh, copy. All right. Oh, now you're copying me. Okay, I see. So the reason why I'm playing Maelstrom today is because I, it's it's been Maelstrom hype. Can someone in the in the comments please tell me why Maelstrom is sixty dollars a piece? The original Maelstrom. Because the reverse is nuts, dude. I don't see the implications yet. Yo, the reverse is crazy. All right, ready? Stand up, stand up, bong up. And I'm up first, so I draw for turn. Almost had the nuts in my hand, but we got a ride, uh, flash triple Odysseus, draw one card, and then pass the turn you. Stay and draw? Oh, I thought, okay, okay, okay. Uh, die problem? Skill of Goyusha, draw. Gain a shield. Skill of die problem? Revealing dies there, shoving it on the bottom of the deck. I'll okay. draw two. The banker needs to stop all these goddamn pot of greens. Play turn order. All right. Swing, eat Vanguard. No guard. Critical trigger. Critical Vanguard. Power to turn order. Damage check, no trigger. Second check. Critical trigger, power to Odysseus. 18 to your 17. Uh, let's see. We'll guard with a 5k shield. You may go. Okay. Stand and draw. We will ride Blue Storm, Blue Storm Soldier Edimal skill. Reveal a uh, Maelstrom to you. Mm -hmm. They keep this 5k. Sure. Uh, we'll go ahead and call out Drift Flow Fencer skill. Check top seven for a Maelstrom. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. It's a whiff. Unfortunate. And we'll go ahead and call out Analyze Shooter. We'll go in the battle. We'll go 16 to the Vanguard with an on hit. I will go over trigger to pass. Draw trigger check. No trigger. Fencer will attack your rear guard for nine. That's A OK. All right, and pass the turn to you. Stand and draw. Ride. Toxic Monster Gale Sludge. Okay. Gale Sludge is skill. I'm going to Soul Blast 1. I'm going to choose for you to either pay a Counter Blast or I will draw a card. You can go ahead and draw the card. Call to order. Move to battle. We're going to swing 17 to your Vanguard. No guard. No trigger. Damage check. Draw trigger. Power to the Vanguard, draw one. You may go. Stand. Draw. We'll go ahead and ride into Blue Storm Dragon Maelstrom. We'll go Excel 2, draw a card. All right. Call in Tidal Salt to the Excel. Call in another Analyze Shooter. All right. Activating Maelstrom skill, Counter Blast 1, giving the front row plus 3k. And then we will proceed to battle. Millister will attack 15, 21, twin drive. I will take the hit. First check, no trigger. Second check, no trigger. No trigger. Activating the on his skill of Analyze Shooter, we'll go ahead and discard one card, so blast one card. 
and then search my deck for up to two Maelstroms with different names and add them to the hand. I'm surprised this card hasn't gone up in price, too. I know, Analyze Shooter is just so good. One hit, then two. But I'm also mad that Japan got fucking um, SP versions of it. We can't have anything good around here. What do you mean? Like, I'll show you some nice things that we have in just a second. Oh, whatever. Alright, so now we're going to go into battle number two. So this is going to be 14, 17 to the Vanguard. I will heal Gullet, giving 10k to my back. Alright, so my unit restands minus 5k. So that's now... That's now 9. Four, uh, 9 plus 3 is 12, doesn't hit. And then we'll go ahead and attack. So this card states... Uh, when it attacks, if you have four, is if it's the fourth battle, which it is, and you have a Vanguard Maelstrom, it gains plus 15k. So we'll add 15k to Flow Fencer with an on hit. So that's now 21, 24, 24 plus 9 is 33. And if, with two on hits, if this hits, my Vanguard will resand. Well, perfect here. All right. And we'll pass the turn. Stand and draw. We'll ride. Die line there. Force two. Alright. Witch destroyer. Go into Geomorphs. We'll swing. Twin Order skill on boost is in my Vanguard's getting an extra 10k for every one of my Force Markers, which is currently one. Okay. And then skill of Geomoglass on attack. Counterboss one. Flip itself face up. I'm going to check top seven and call two units. Call Die Kaiser, call Gale Sludge. So, my Vanguard is then going to get an extra crit for every grade 3 on my board. Currently, one is going to be a three crit swing. Okay. Gale Sludge is also going to get his on place. I'm going to Soul Blast one. And since you are at grade 3, I get to choose both of the actions. Yeah. So, if you do not Soul Blast and Counter Blast, you will both lose 5,000 power, and I will draw a card. So the counter blast is for the draw and the soul blast is for the power? Yep. All right, so you can go ahead and draw your card and then I will soul blast one so I stay at 12. All right. So this is going to be 20, I'll take it 30 crits. 41 on three crits. And then we're going to go complete guard, drop. All right. Triple drive. First check, critical trigger. We'll go power to gale sludge. Okay. Critical to die Kaiser. Got it. Second check. And the third check. No triggers. So this has the crit, and this has the 10k power. Mm -hmm. All right. Yep. And then since Geoma Glass is both face up and on board, all of my grade threes are going to get 10k power. Got it. I'll swing 19 to the Vanguard. I'm going to go with the no guard over trigger. So we'll give the... 100 million power to my Vanguard and then draw one card. We're going to swing 23 to Flow Fencer. Uh, no guard. And we will pass turn there. Alright. So let's see, we're going to stand. Okay. Draw for turn. That's a good draw. We'll go ahead and ride into. Blue Storm Dragon Glory Maelstrom to get another Excel. Draw again. And then we'll go into a Generation Strive. Blue Storm Stow Dragon, Genbol Dragon. Genbol's on play skill. Allows you to check the top seven and call two units as rest. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Okay, what is this hundred? Alright. So we'll go ahead and verify. Tire this to call this rest over, and then we'll go ahead and call this as rest. Send these two 
So we need three back. Um, shuffle the deck. All right. Then we're going to go ahead and call out a Blue Storm Soldier Edermos uh, skill. Because my Vanguard is a Maelstrom, I don't have to reveal one, so it keeps this plus five. Or well, keeps this five, ma maintaining it at ten. We call a Glory Maelstrom, activating Odysseus skill. I put one of my rear guards into my soul, and then I would check my deck for a unit with the same grade as my Vanguard as a Ripple card and ride it because I don't have one, I just shuffle. Then I would call Wheel Assault to the extra rear guard circle. And I'll also call Direct Strike Brave Shooter to rear guard. Okay, activating Edamos' skill, Counter Blast 1. Putting a Maelstrom from my drop zone into my soul. He gets plus 4k. I can attack from the back row. Just because I have it now, attack from the back row. <laughs> Alright. Then we will proceed to battle. So it's two, four, that makes six. So we'll go, we'll just leave Tyro Soul alone. We'll go 13 at your Vanguard. I will intercept. Okay. Second battle, swing and nothing. We'll go 14 at your, at your Vanguard. I'll guard here. Okay. We'll attack, activating Ginvol Dragon's own attack skill. Counter Blast 1, turn a card face up in a G zone. We'll turn a Maelstrom. For every two rest of the rearguards, I get to draw a card. So two, four, six. I get to draw three. And for every card that I draw, you retire a rearguard. And then if I drew three or more, I get to stand up to two of my rearguards. So stand. And stand and then skill plus 10k to the vanguard. Draw one card. I'll take the hit. All right, triple drive. First check, heal trigger plus five. We'll give all effects to title assault. And then we get to heal one. Second check, no trigger. Final check, no trigger. Damage check, no trigger. All right, then we'll go 13 at the Vanguard. Oh wait, before we do that, activate skill because the attack hit. Um, yep, drop this, Soul Blast 1. Search for two Maelstroms and add them to the hand. Glory, and we're out of Blue Storm Dragons. Step, please. Okay, proceed to the next battle. We'll go 13 at the Vanguard. I'll take the hit. Okay. No trigger. 14 at the Vanguard. Guard here. 19 at the Vanguard. Generation guard. Only G So Geo skill. So what's it get cheated? Okay. Minus 5k off the title. Title of salt will stand. We'll go 14 at the Vanguard for the last attack. Guard with this edge. Okay. And then D stride and pass the turn to you. Alright. Stand and draw. We'll strive. All right. Bravest Peak, Excalibur. Ooh, there we go. So, GB3 is active. It's going to gain an extra 10,000 power for every card in my G zone. Draw three. three. I'm going to call Doc Kaiser. And I'm going to call Die Jacker. Call Rinko. Rinko's skill. Shove it into soul. Mm -hmm. 
You draw a card, I'll have the Sentinel break ability. Okay. Sweet top deck. Dizaris. All right. Move to battle. Swing with Dizaris boosted by Dijacker. Since I still have two Geo face up and G zone, they're going to get an extra 10k power each. Okay. So we're going to what? 20k power each? No, 10. Yep, 10 total. Okay. So it's going to be 23, 31, that guard. 31. All right. So we are going to guard for 15 to make 27. And then we'll intercept the title to make it 32. Skill of Dizaris. Sends it into the soul. Okay. They take an extra 10k power. And an extra drop. Got it. Dijacker's skill. Retires itself. Gives my vanguard an extra crit. Okay. So I'm swinging for three damage. Yep. Swing with Excalibur. Excalibur skill. Kind of lost one on the flip. Gives an extra 10k power. And an extra drive. So currently we're going to be at 60, 28, 38, 48, 58, 68, 78. 78, you need to hit 80 for the restand, right? Yep, just need to hit one trigger. One trigger for the restand, that's crazy. And I have uh, five drives. <laughs> that's fucking crazy. All right, so before we continue, can I get a trigger check? One, two, three, four, five. All right, so five out of 16, which means there are 11 triggers left. Um, and three damage coming my way. I am going to go... And, and if I check a grade three, I can swing last one and sentinel break. So that's one attack. This is your second attack. There's no way I'm passing over. All right. No guard. Are you at two or three? I'm at two damage. All right. First check, heal trigger. We're gonna go power vanguard. Okay. So it's 60. I'll heal damage. Second check. Third check. Fourth check. Fifth check. All green three. Good no. So yeah. I take three damage. Mm -hmm. First check, draw trigger. We'll give plus 10k power to the vanguard, draw one card. Second check, no trigger. Third check, no trigger. Three stands. Okay. One drive. Generation guard. This is your second battle. So seeing how I have face up damage, face up G units. We're going to Guardian of Land and Sky, Sky and Water, Neohannes. Neohannes is skill. Counter blast one, turn a card face up in my G zone or G guardian. I get to choose up to five of my rear guards. One, two, three, four, five. They cannot be targeted nor attacked. And then he gains 5k for each one, so plus 25k to the shield. So 25 plus 15 is what, 40? Mm -hmm. 40, 50, 62, so how much? 98. 62. 68. 88. So I need 30 to make it one to pass. Mm -hmm. So 10, 20, 30, 30 for one to pass. Mm -hmm. That's it? That's it. Uh, actually, let me, let me read what the... So we're going to choose a sentinel. Choose a sentinel and break it, right? Mm -hmm. No trigger damage. And that guards that. But I don't, I don't think I'm out of the safe zone yet. <laughs> yeah, you're at what, 22? 22 right now. 28, Vanguard. You only have threes left in your hand. No, I have, how much is it, 28? Yep. I'm 5K short. <laughs> so I need to hit a heel trigger to live. Perish. Heel trigger, <laughs> let's go. <laughs> let's go. Plus 5K to the Vanguard and I heal one damage. All right. So I think you're about to perish now. I don't know. I'm only at two. I, I've clapped people from two to six with this deck. Stand and draw. We'll ride into another glory. Nothing to get 
the another Excel draw. And then we'll go with a Generation Strider with the crit. Mm -hmm. We'll go into Blue Storm, Breaking Dragon, and Golf Maelstrom. Okay. We'll call a Glory, activating Odysseus' skill to shove it into the soul. Because I don't have a target, we're just going to shuffle the deck. Okay. Cut, please. We'll call Flow Fencer. Check top seven. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. No Maelstroms. Okay. Cut one more time. And then we'll call Real Assault. And then activate Edermost's skill. Counter Blast 1. Putting a Maelstrom from my drop zone into my soul. It gets plus 4k power. It can attack from the back row. Okay. Activating Maelstrom skill. Flipping over a Maelstrom in my G zone. Flipping over a card in my G zone, which is a Maelstrom. And then if I have two or more Maelstroms face up in my G zone, plus 5k and a crit. Mm -hmm. So plus 5k to the Vanguard and plus one crit. All right. And then skill. If it's on the fourth battle, fourth battle only, when it attacks, you are not allowed to guard with one or less Maelstroms in my soul. So otherwise, other words, if I have five, you're not allowed to guard with fours of blow, and that even stops you from G-guarding. So we're going to go into battle. We'll go 13 to the Vanguard. Guard with Kaiser. Okay. We'll attack for 13 again. I will intercept. Okay, 14. 12. We'll attack for 13 again. Guard with Dion. 15k shield. Okay. No, not 25k shield actually, because of dial on it. Attack for 14. Oh, uh, wait, that's one, two, three. This will be the fourth battle. Attack with Maelstrom. No guard. All right, triple drive. So check no trigger. Critical trigger. We'll give critical to the Vanguard. So plus a number crit. We'll give the 10k power here. Third check. Draw trigger, we'll draw one and we'll give another 10k power over here. That is three damage to you. First check, second check, heal trigger, power vanguard. Final check, heat critical trigger, power vanguard. Okay, so how much are you? 33 base. 33 base. This is 10, this is going to be 24 base. This can't hit. So then this will swing, skill gains another 15k power. So it has plus 25, 30, 39. We will just G guard it. Alright. Does not matter what I go into. No, 39 you said, right? 39, yes. Okay, so I have to use Geo. Uh, Geo is going to soul blast one. Alright, we'll just pass turn there. You live to see another turn and see what you can do. Stand and draw. I could start you. Don't start me. You sure? Don't do it. I really want to start you. Don't do it. <laughs> I could start you, and then when you have to PG one of the swings, I can just hit you with fucking die Kaiser. That's insulting. You only have one intercept, too? Ooh. Only have one interceptor. Oh, it's tempting. Die Kaiser is tempting right now. But nah, so. Let's try. Okay. We'll just play Triple Wing. Excalibur. Mm -hmm. Excalibur's GB. Okay. Currently getting an extra 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60,000 power. So you're at 70... I'm at 88. 88. So you have to restand. Mm -hmm. We're going to call Die Kaiser. Okay. We're going to call Die Kaiser. Ooh. All right. We're going to move to battle. Swing. Skill. Mm -hmm. Okay. We're going to flip over the final geo. It's going to get another 10k power. So we're going to get one... 
Fucking hell. Oh, God. Yeah, there's no point to that. I can't stop the second swing. All right, looks like you got it, man. No guard. First check. Second check. Third check, critical trigger. All effects vanguard. Final check. Draw trigger. Power to die liner. Damage check. Heal trigger. Power to the vanguard, I heal. Second check. And that's the game. All right, man, good game. All right, so you guys saw the devastation that, that just happened. He, he lived. He's the boy who lived. Irish. <laughs> but do you see the merits of both decks and how strong both decks can be in premium? And they're just going to get even stronger with their new support. That's what I want to do. So when you guys see, when you guys will also see what we do with these decks when the new support comes with my Maelstrom Reverse and his original saver zero so hope you guys will tune in for that and see what we come up we'll see what we cook up with and until then we will see you guys later later